Hi Cancer, it's Elle here to do your uh, oracle reading for the week. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Happy birthday, Cancer. That's what I wanted to say. Um, let's go ahead and jump into this. Thank you, Lord God, for blessing Cancer with a clear, concise mes message from you. Okay, so, um, Cancer, let's see what's going on for you. shuffling for you um i got the well the page of cups popped out so i don't know if you get getting a lot, a lot of dreams downloads synchronicity the pages are earth earth of whatever suits so earth of cups earth of emotions so when you talk about earth you talk about something being realized so it's like i don't know if the universe wants you to realize that you need to give a message to or that you'll receive a message from a loving message of or from someone. Um, let's see what's going on here. So we have uh, an energy of I want you when I want you. I don't know if that's you, Cancer, or the other person. And then we have don't worry about fixing me, fix you. Okay. So someone is saying, look, I want you when I want you. This is you know how the relationship will go I'm gonna set the tone for the relationship don't worry about fixing me I'm not interested in healing you fix yourself and then there's also an energy of someone saying look if you find somebody new I'm just going to pursue you just to sabotage your new connection okay so there's an energy of someone saying if you go and find someone else I'm just gonna come back so I can uh, mess that up this is either you or another person you're dealing with cancer Let's see. Let's see wow so now we have for the streets period so we have someone who is literally just I don't know if you can make a happy home with this person. I don't know if you're going to ever get your wishes fulfilled. They are just for the streets. They are not anybody that you want to bring home or that you want to have a close relationship with. Um, maybe you could be realizing this about someone or they're realizing it about you. If someone is trying to fix you, you're not interested in being fixed. You want to, you're like, look, go fix yourself. Um... There's also an energy of someone saying, I've never known love like this before. So someone is in love. There's a toxic energy of sabotage, of running interference, of if you don't want to be with me, then I'm just going to make your life a living hell. Even though I don't want you in a serious capacity or I can't give you that, I'm still going to manipulate you, manipulate the energy, and just cause confusion. Either confusion with you, just in your own mindset, play mental games with you, or going to cause confusion within any connection that you're in. There's also an energy of someone saying, I've never known love like this before. Okay, I think this might be a di another set of cancers. I don't know. Okay. Someone is saying, you knew what this was from the beginning. So someone is saying, look, you knew that I, I was for the streets. I wasn't anybody to take serious. I was not someone that you should uh, be looking to build a home with, a house with. Um, you knew that I wasn't interested in healing or fixing myself. Um, 
you know that I'm toxic. I, I will sabotage things, okay? Let's see. Ooh, Cancer, this is some serious energy. Whoa. Someone's saying, look, this is an eight-party relationship. I'm open to everybody. So somebody has options out, out the wazoo. Like, they... They have not closed anything down. They're not turning down anything also. But then there's an energy of, will you just take me back already? Jeez. I don't know if someone, they want you to take them back, but they haven't changed. Someone is saying, I've never known love like this before. I will sabotage you if you find someone else. This is interesting. Um... Someone saying, I have a girlfriend or a boyfriend, but I want you too. This could be your energy, Cancer. It could be the other person's energy. I'm not sure. Um, this is a, a heavy-duty, <laughs> karmic, toxic situation here. Last card. All right. Yeah, unfair treatment. So someone either treated you unfair, or you, you're realizing that you treated someone else unfair, Again, about the Page of Cups coming in off camera about a message or psychic downloads or someone is getting synchronicities and being pushed maybe even in their dreams or in their dream, sca uh, dream space. Someone is about to call you or text you, okay? Or this is what you, you want to do or this is what you need to do. Let's see what you're dealing with. Thank you, Lord God, for blessing these cards with cancer. Somebody really needs a doctor. They really need to go see seek help. Here, okay and maybe this is why someone said um, you know I'm not uh, don't worry about fixing me fix you because someone knows that someone has maybe um, a disorder a mental disorder some type of disorder that is going undiagnosed um, someone needs to go and cope with their issues that they've been bandaging up but not dealing with service someone could be in the service industry hospitality industry something where they have to be of service to um someone was in service to the other someone was giving to the connection more than the other they felt like they were in servitude or in, yeah, in service to the other person or just the connection altogether. Um, there's deep deep sorrow this could be the widower uh, the divorcee, excuse me, not the widower, but the divorcee, this could be someone who, you know, they had to walk away from their family or their union, and they're in deep grief about this, um, because this is loss, this is loss for them. Um, that could be you, Cancer, it could be someone else, the halting is, because somebody is just way too arrogant, conceited, um, disloyal, um, they get a lot of attention and they internalize that attention and it's, they turn it into negative. It's just a negative, toxic, you know, attention whore for some of you. This could be you. This could be the person you're dealing with. Someone is, well, foe coming out. Someone is seeing the comparison in two um, of another thing or of another person. Someone is seeing the, the different side of um, the different side of, of offense or a different side of two people or someone there is two people here and they compare these people how uh, these people are deeply different from one another here they're in contrast to to one another there could be someone here who likes two people for different reasons. Consolation here. Um, you, could, you could be receiving a little bit of money or a little bit of something, but it is not enough. It's just enough to get by. Something is holding something up. Someone just needs a little bit of something or a little bit of communication. The journey card. Somebody really needs to go on a self-discovery journey and start to pick up on different things about themselves and their own personality. 
someone could travel for work also someone is in deep desire for another thing or a person place or thing um, they're longing for this thing it, they're craving it um, they needed to feed their emotions their uh, Like some pleasure field thing. I don't know. This is an interesting reading. Let's see if I can open. Somebody is a pleasure seeker. They go after what feels good and they don't think about the consequences or the repercussions of just that thing, of doing that thing. And they don't think about the aftermath. You know, they have the aftermath of this. Somebody, somebody may have left a, a connection and then they, whomever left the connection, they left this person to their own devices and maybe even left them to another person. But now, I don't know, you cancer or the other person is feeling like this other person is not enough. They're looking at the comparison of who left the connection and they're like, this is not enough. I'm... I'm I need the other person back. And that's why they're um, they're uh, seeking this other person. They're desiring, craving the other person. There could be addiction here. Overindulgence. Uh, drinking. Smoking. I don't know. There could be someone drinking now because they're in a place of, of not having enough. Or somebody's not enough. Mm. What is cancer doing? Okay. Beauty queen. Okay, so they're seeing someone as the beauty queen or maybe they went towards the beauty queen but they're seeing that that's not enough. Um, someone is um, saying that you are the beauty queen. Um, maybe they need more or there is more to you. Um, someone sees you as living your best life, getting a lot of attention, dressing up, looking well, being better. Let's see. Control. Someone had a very controlling nature. They tried to control, be the puppeteer in this connection here. They tried to control more than one party um, so that they can get what they wanted. It, looked like, it looks like somebody left a connection and they left the other person to their own devices, to whatever it is they left them to. But this person feels like it's not enough. Um, I want what has left me. I'm longing for what is gone now. Um, I didn't know what I had until it was gone. And now somebody is being prompted to message the other person or reach out or to kind of see what's going on with another person. Um, they could have been very controlling in the, in the past. We got a young female, yep. So Cancer, they could see you as the beauty queen, getting a lot of attention, looking good, dressing well, living your life. Um, this person tried to control you, tried to control the narrative, control two people. And we have two people, the young female and the beauty queen. Um, they try to maybe even compare you to this young female, this person that they weren't serious with or serious to. This person that is not serious about life right now. The young female specifically talks about maybe a female under the age of 25, 25 and younger, or maybe even older, but just has a youthful vibe about them is just about themselves it's not about connection and family they're not there yet not to say that they won't ever be there um maybe somebody tried to juggle the two ice king yeah somebody felt like they had um their heart chakra is closed here um what they have to give is life experience um philosophy help um, but, they, but their emotional self is closed. They are unavailable emotionally. This could be you. This could be the other person. Something, something about being unavailable, not available to. Let's see what else. Yeah, 
gossip. There's a lot of um, talk surrounding um, you cancer or someone you're dealing with. Lots of gossip in terms of uh, who you're with now and who you left or who left you. Somebody is definitely craving, desiring the passion to be reignited between uh, someone that could have left the connections. Cancer, you may be having a new love, a, a new lease on life, maybe even a new lover come in, or just a new love for something here. Um, let me leave you with a tarot card that sums up this reading. There's somebody really desiring you to be with you, to be in connection with you, to hold you, to caress you, to hug you. Um, it, it, this is not you, Cancer. It's the other person. Whoever left the connection, there's a deep desire for... If you left the connection, then the person you left is desiring you. If the person left you, then you're desiring them. So there's deep desire between you and another person here. Someone who tried to control the narrative here. Six of Wands. Okay. So um, either... This is a cheating scandal here. Okay. Um, pride comes before the fall. Someone was very prideful and they forgot where they came from. Um, they forgot um, how to treat people. It looks like somebody left the connection and now they're off strutting their stuff, getting attention, accolades elsewhere. Someone won the battle by leaving the battle. Not the war, but definitely the battle. Someone wants attention on them. If someone's not paying you attention or you're not paying someone attention, they want the attention to come back on them or you want the attention back on you. This is a, a salacious scandal. And maybe that's why there is gossip or there is something scandalous about uh, this connection here. Someone could be married, was married. Um, yeah. Interesting reading. Someone was very childish, okay? But now, and, and there's a lot of argument and discord because of somebody's childishness, childish ways, not seeing the air of their ways. But now someone is getting it. There's also a need for somebody to grow up. Really just grow up. Grow up, grow into the person that you really should be. It's like somebody won't go from boy to man, from girl to woman. It's almost as if they're stuck in some paradigm here. Some time warp. There's a lot of gossip surrounding you, Cancer, or another person. If this reading resonates for you, go over to the website, book your own oracle reading there. Take advantage of the text question, where you can text a question to the number below. You can also donate to the channel if you're feeling moved to. And if you feel like you need to release some things in your life, you can get in on the full moon manifestation ritual happening. All the information is below in the description box. Thank you, Cancer. Many blessings to you. Take care.